hello guys good morning welcome back to my channel please endeavor to subscribe to my channel and like the videos as you might have all known i don't base my videos on specific things my videos are on relevant things that might that might have that might be causing problems for some of us in our homes in our offices and so on so today I'm going to be sharing with you my encounter with Hyper Wallet. Um, I get to know of Hyper Wallet just about a few weeks ago when my first payment was sent to me. My first invoice, sorry, was sent to me from uh, Telos International AI Community. Telos is an AI based community where tasks are being done online and then after a 30 days cycle, they pay you through hyper wallet so as you can see here tell us international but the website itself is hyper wallet the site is telling me that my login is failed error 104 contact customer support for assistance um you see their customer support is kind of helpful like they reply to your message directly they don't reply to your message as in a company they reply to your message as in in person in person when i mean in person the person who is replying the message does not reply in the name of the company the person reply in the name of i saw your message i am aware of your problems and so on and so forth and that's a little bit you know comforting and here i've been trying to log in and you know having issues with the login so here's my detail you can see the same thing is happening login field error 104 contact customer support for assistance well i don't know what is wrong with these people I keep sending them emails and you know their responses is kind of disturbing like they don't trust me it is my name all through my name you can see here it's been about seven emails first was about my pioneer account not being added you know I complained so much about that and they did nothing and I'm afraid it seems like they decided to block my account because I was complaining too much about the Pioneer thing. Yeah, I was complaining about the Pioneer using my dollar account, but they, I decided to use my um, Great Britain Pound account, which has worked. But I prefer the dollar account because using the Great Britain account, they would have to remove some charges for converting from US dollar to Britain pound which I don't want that was why I was complaining to them about you know using my dollar account which they kept telling me that I can't use the dollar account anymore because I have changed the dollar account from pioneer which they are requesting for they were requesting for the first dollar account which I don't have anymore now i cannot use the dollar account but unfortunately this morning i sent the last message i think three days ago and this morning when i tried to log in i can't log in so i don't know what is wrong i don't know why hyper wallet is being this strict for me i don't know maybe other persons are facing the same problem i also discovered that um paypal which is a subsidiary to pioneer does not even accept money for Nigerians. I don't know why all this is happening to poor countries like ours. Nigeria, for that matter. You can't get paid through PayPal. Don't try it. PayPal is not going to pay you. In fact, they are not even going to accept your money. And the same thing, Pioneer is giving headache. After the verification troubles, here we come trying with hyper wallet why are all these company all this platform making it difficult for the engineers to get paid for the hard work they've been doing Imagine